Hey, this is Matt, and I wanted to show you a new dialog we, we've redesigned in the latest version of SmartView. It's the function builder. When we uh, first set off to design this dialog, our main goal was to make it feel like you were using the Excel function builder. It's what people have been used to in Excel, and it makes the most sense. So right away, you get a list of the available functions in SmartView, and they give you some uh, brief description of what the function can do. When you go ahead and select a function, you're going to get a typical experience you'd get when building a function in Excel. Um, we do add a lot of helper features that make it smart view specific. So for instance, I can go ahead and I can grab a specific connection I'm already connected to, or I can use the active connection if I wanted to. In this case, I'll grab a, a connection that I'm already connected to. Um, and here, if I wanted to, I can use Excel functionality and build my member list. But again, I'm going to leverage smart view functionality that's built into this function builder quickly bring up the member selection dialog. By default, uh, the top of the house members are selected for me. If I want to, I can go in here and I could uh, change one of these to a specific member. Hit OK, and I've, I've essentially built out my function. But I want to be a little more precise here, and I want to use some Excel formulas to make this function uh, even more dynamic. So I'm going to go ahead and erase January there, the reference that I just put in there. And again, I'm going to use the dialog to be able to choose my cell for January. Hit OK here. Hit OK. And you can see the function gets built for me. The cell reference is in place. In fact, I can just copy that right over and see the values for January, February, and March. It's a great, easy way to build functions. In fact, there's a whole library of functions that I might want to use. If I bring up that wizard again, I'll choose one like Get Sheet Info, which is a great function for getting things like connection name or other properties that are on the sheet that might be important to me. I'll go ahead and choose friendly name. This will give me the friendly connection name that I've defined um, for this specific connection so I, I know uh, what I'm connected to when I retrieve this data. Hit OK here and I can see that. Go ahead and refresh this data and I see my updated values for the, the various months. My functions are in place and I have my connection name uh, in cell A1 there. If I want to, I can go ahead and just edit one of these connections. It's really simple. It's designed based on what users are used to in Excel, and I think it makes a lot of sense, and I know users are going to really love it. Thanks.